I love the versatility of sea kayaking. I love being able to pack up my boat for 10 days, go camping on the coast and potentially not see anyone. And I also love being able to bring it to a place like this and go surfing for a few hours or take it up to Quadra Island and play in current. So it kind of gives me all of the adrenaline that I wanted from rivers in one kind of tool or one boat, so to say. I loved guiding, but instructing gave me the ability to give back to students and give back to other kayakers so they could then go and do what I love doing rather than taking people out for a day or two and then not walk away with any skills. So I fell in love with the ability to teach people and for them to find their own limits. Level four instructors, I'm the only female and I'm the only female as a level three instructor trainer and that's in the history of Paddle Canada. Part of my drive to get to the top in a short period of time was creating opportunities for more young people to get on the water and also for more women to have female coaches so they could keep pushing themselves at higher levels and be able to run all women's courses. I also saw that there was a bit of a demand when I was teaching to be able to give instruction on how to paddle the Greenland and so I didn't want to have my students not get answers. I love surfing the waves with the Greenland. Part of it is because it's a different technique, so it allows me to get my paddle in a little bit deeper and closer. It also puts me and my boat in a different position, so it puts me closer to where the waves are breaking. The other part is that it also allows me to be able to teach people that are transitioning to using their Greenland all the time, rather than using it touring and switching to a Euro in the surf. And I also like challenging myself, so a Euro blade is fun. Learning how to paddle with the Greenland and surf just opens another door for me. I think a lot of people focus a lot on the catch phase of a Euro blade, which is at the front, so you have a lot of immediate get up and go. The Greenland, the most power you're getting is during the stroke, so you actually don't feel that same start to go, but you have more momentum carrying you forward with less impact. So I think once people wrap their heads around that, they can find that power that the Greenland can offer, just not at the same part of the stroke. I personally like the support that the Greenland gives me in the waves or getting off of the waves. I know that rather than having this much blade, I have this much blade, so it gives me that extra sense of security. I think if you're used to paddling with a Euro blade, the Greenland is the next step forward. You know, it gives you a lot of versatility, it teaches you different techniques to paddling. So people that don't want a Greenland, you're only holding yourself back, I think. Adding a Greenland to your quiver or to your kayaking closet will only benefit you further. You know, can let me go longer and also can allow me to play in some fun waves. My name is Amber Champion and I'm a professional kayaker and I kayak for fun. <laughs>